It's about midway through the LaSalle men's and women's cross country season, and both teams will be taking on one of their biggest tasks as they head to pre-nationals hosted by Indiana State University. Most of the best teams in the nation will be running in this race, previewing the course that they hope to be racing on at NCAA nationals in the late fall. Both teams have been training very hard in preparation for their race against such staunch competition. We're preparing well. I think that this workout especially is going to help us a lot with um, speed. The practices are going well. I think that as a team we're all on the same page. We all kind of want to um, go there, get points. Um, I, I think we're ready as a team. We've done a bunch of workouts. The one we did today is pretty good. Got a uh, change in the speeds. Uh, which will help in such a large field. The workouts have been good though, we're ready to go. The women look to feed off of the competition and work well together, while the men see a hot start as the key to success in this race. There's so many people surrounding you and so many people around you that it's almost impossible not to be pushed by people. You just kind of go with who you're with and uh, it's a constant race. You're never left alone. I think we need to just get out fast, put ourselves in a good position early on and then just try and maintain and build off that. If we can do that, I think we'll be in a good spot, hopefully beat a few good teams and move ourselves up in the rankings. Most teams at this point in the season are losing runners to injury, but the LaSalle Explorer women are gaining a runner that made it to regionals in the 10K last spring. Senior Steph Barish will be making her season debut at Prenats after returning from an IT band injury. She hopes her presence will make an immediate impact on the team. My goal is just to be healthy enough for the rest of my team and to hopefully pick up some points uh, where we were, might have been lacking at uh, maybe Navy or Paul Short. Having Steph back will definitely be an improvement to our top five. It'll give us a pack of five that can hopefully run two and a half miles, three miles into a race. And if nothing more, it'll be some good mental intimidation against other teams. With all of the hard work and preparation Barish and the rest of the men's and women's cross country teams have been putting in, pre nat should be another strong performance for the Explorers. For Sportsline, I'm John LaPuma. Now back to the studio.